In this quick get going tutorial, let's talk about testing the SSD drive on PCIe bus inside of the new MacBook Air 2013. This SSD drive is smoking fast and we can test it with our Blackmagic disk test. I downloaded the app, put it in my applications folder. Let's go ahead and double click on it and open it up. So right now it's looking at the system drive. Okay, so I'm going to give it a stress test of five gigabytes. And now let's click on the speed test start button and look how fast the SSD is in this MacBook Air. Okay, it starts out, so there's the right, peaking out around, you know, 652 megabytes a second. So here's the read. Now, check it out. It's going to get a little bit faster, actually, when it passes around again. Get a little bit higher on the read side. And we'll stop the test. And I'll just run it one more time now that the drive is kind of warmed up a little bit. So once again, you can see the write speed's really good. I mean, it's over 600 megabytes a second, and the read is close to almost to 700. Every now and then, I'll see it spike to 700. So now I have this Western Digital 2 terabyte My Passport drive connected that is USB 3. Let's test out the speed on this drive. So we'll go select Target Drive. And let's go down here to the two terabyte. I'll click choose, and now I'll run the speed test. So yeah, you can see that this little external hard drive, which is probably 5,400 RPM connected to a USB 3 uh, port, you know, it's still doing a pretty good job considering where we've been with hard drives, around 100 megabytes read and write. That's pretty good for this Western Digital two terabyte My Passport drive. And I've run the test before, and it's not really going to get much better. It's going to average around 100 megabytes read and write. All right, cool. So that was a quick little demo of the SSD PCIe drive inside of our MacBook Air 2013 and a 2 terabyte Western Digital drive. Thanks for watching.